Yo, what is up everybody? It is Running Fisher 2000 here back with another tutorial and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to live stream games from your iOS device to your PC or to Mob Crush. Before I start this, let me tell you guys what Mob Crush is. So Mob Crush is a platform where you can live stream games and yeah, they recently came out with a PC version of, of, of Mob Crush. And it's pretty cool because you can actually customize what type of microphone you're using, what camera you're using, and a bunch of other stuff which I will show you in this tutorial. So the first thing you want to do is head over to Google Chrome and go to mobcrush.com slash broadcast, click on the iOS tab, and click on this download Mob Crush for PC Alpha. It's going to put this mobcrush.exe right here, you want to go ahead and click on that once, click on run and then it's going to go ahead and run the application. Go ahead and install it. I'm not gonna install it because I already did it, but it's a fairly simple installation process like where to save it to, put a desktop icon. But during the setup, it's going to ask you to restart your computer. Restart your computer and once you boot up, it's going to uh, pop up with a box to continue the installation process. So once you have fully completed the setup, it's going to put this icon on your desktop right here. And what you want to do is go ahead and double click on the icon. It's going to load up Mob Crush. And the first thing it will ask you to do is log in with your Mob Crush account. If you don't have one, create one. And then you can start streaming as you guys can see. Now the software is really laggy. It tends to freeze every so often. Um, this is just a bug with the software right now. It's still alpha. This is the first version of this uh, software. So they're still working on improving it. But let's go over here on this top part. Mob Crush, if you click this, you can log out or quit Mob Crush. You can change the orientation, the connection speed, which I'm going to put to high. Window, you can make it full screen. Let's go ahead and do that. And help, about, and Mob Crush help. So, uh, let's go ahead and call this a title broadcast title. Let's just call it test, because why not? Game name, it's required, but I have it on other. You can choose a from a whole list of games right here. When I click on it, it tends to lag, so let's just keep it on other. And you can actually have an overlay too, so say my phone pops up, it's going to have this in the background. And also, people tend to have like an outline like right here of like just a cool background and then their Twitter name here, their YouTube username, Instagram name. It's pretty cool how you can have an overlay. I'm not sure if it can be animated or not, but maybe they'll improve that in the future. You can select a camera, your own custom web camera. But for some reason, I have the PS3 i camera, and the program doesn't seem to recognize it even though nothing's wrong with it. So I tweeted them, They, uh, I sent it to support, and hopefully they take a look at it. Microphone input, this is my microphone right here, and our mobile device. So this part, you, what you want to do is plug in your iPhone to your computer. So I'm about to plug mine in, and I just plugged it in. So let's just let it boot up, and as you guys can see, it did pop up. So, what you want to do is click on the select device tab and choose the iOS device. Now, I don't know why it says iOS device B21. Um, I wish it said the actual name of your device, so I call mine Jordan's iPhone 5. But let's just go ahead and click on it either way, and let's let it uh, turn on. So, um, so, let's go ahead and turn, click that away. And uh, I believe once you click this, your phone screen should show up. And it's not sure why, why it's not showing up right now. Um, but yeah, so let's go ahead and start the stream just to make it a test. So you click this little M right here to start the stream. And then, um, yeah, you should be good to go. I'm not sure why this, uh, over I think it's the overlay which is causing the issue. So let's turn off the overlay. There we go. So as you guys can see, my phone screen did in fact show up. And it's pretty cool how you can actually like live stream. It's it's really really cool. Um, but yeah, so let's go ahead and just take a look at some of the settings. So you click this M again to stop your stream, but I don't want to stop it. Um, go away, emails. I don't care. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and see the camera icon. So let's uh, see what this power button does. I'm not sure what that does. I, I'm assuming it turns off and on your camera. This screen it it minimizes your your the the screen that was used to set up but it still works it just makes it smaller uh this screen right here blurs it so say you have to like put in a password or something and you want to blur it you can click this and it will blur it this one i'm not sure what it does because my camera doesn't actually work uh, but yeah and also uh no i don't want to end that let's take that away go to the volume rock and as you guys can see you can actually change the device sound so this isn't anything but this is the microphone I'm using, and people can hear me right now because uh, I'm streaming. And also uh, the iOS device uh, volume right here. You can turn this down if you want. 
Um, but yeah, it's it's really really cool how you can do all this stuff. So let's uh, go ahead and go into a game real quick. Let's go into Minecraft, and I'll show you guys that these sounds do, sounds do in fact work. So yeah, let's go ahead and test it out. Um, so here we go. Let's go into play, and then let's go into a world. So here we go. So you can see the the gameplay is very smooth. It looks really awesome. Um, go away, Skype. I don't care about you. Um, so let's go ahead and spawn down a mob just to test the sound. So let's go ahead and place down a creeper and let's get a diamond sword out right here. And now let's go ahead and watch the sound bar right here where my mouse cursor is. Uh, why isn't it? Oh, because make sure your ringer, if you're using an iPhone, make sure your ringer is set to uh, not silent. And then watch as I hit the creeper. You can see the sound actually showed. It's pretty cool. I mean, you can see the bar going up, but it's really, really cool how you can actually do that. Um, but yeah, you can still stream, people can still see it, it's really cool. But yeah, guys, that's how you stream games from your iOS device to your PC using Mob Crush. I hope you guys did enjoy this video, and if you did, be sure to follow me, follow me on Mob Crush because I do stream on here since it is summer. I'm going to be streaming a lot more for you guys. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it for this tutorial. There's nothing else too much to go over. If you could click away the settings bar, you can see the chat box right here. Um, you can see the chat, you can talk to chat, you can see who is viewing the stream. Yeah, it's, it's really cool. You can say hi to your people, you can put the stopwatch here, put slow mode on. But yeah, that's pretty much it, and peace out.